Hey, and welcome back to another episode. We're at Clanker's Cavern. We are. Oops. No, nope, you didn't do it. Try again. Almost. If you try again, succeed. Something. Oh, what was that? <laughs> you, <laughs> what was that thing? That's philosophy if by you fail Stu. fail once, try again or something. All right. So there's two things I want to do here. We're going to, so I don't yeah, slip you, and you fall. Yes, I Man, will. you're crazy. Come on. Just there we go. <laughs> Notes. And then I Ginger. hear somebody. Ginger. Oh, bam. Oh, yeah. That's the last one. Wait, wait, stay there. Yeah. I think, oh, I think you have the puzzle. The, yep. The jiggy. Yay. Oh. Look at me. Yo. Yo. <laughs> Hell yeah. You didn't get the other one, though. What other? Oh, no, I didn't. Which is it's the honeycomb. Which is a honeycomb piece. Hell yeah. Go back and get that son. And then you gotta go explore the pipe below. Right. Oh, wait. It's not even. Oh, it's a dead end, actually. That was easy. Oh, yeah, you can hit it just by the jump. I thought you had to do the double jump each time. All right. Now that I'm in here, I have to backflip out. Aw, oh, yeah, chicken legs. I got really good. <laughs> that, used to be a, that used to be a nickname. Because I, no. <laughs> I was a really small kid. And, like, I was skinny. I was really skinny. Uh -huh. And so people called me chicken legs at one point. Hilarious. For a little while. Can... Oh, no, we were already been over there. So <laughs> let's just go underneath. Stuff. Mine was, uh, I picked up playing basketball, and, uh, my last name starts with a B, so it was white naturally BB Butterfingers. White, white Brandon can't jump? Oh, BB <laughs> Butterfingers, nice. Yeah, so, like, I dropped the ball one time, and all of a sudden I'm BB Butterfingers never because of the, the candy, the Butterfinger BBs. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, hey. That was easy. This loops around, so you can see it from the other side. Yeah, but then you have to go on this perilous journey through this pipe while you freak the fuck out. Right. When you're trying to get back, and you're like, I'm running out of breath! Oh right, my god! Right, because getting the jiggy is only half the battle. You're yes. like, hey, I got it! But then you gotta go all the way back. You gotta survive the, you gotta survive. Survive the ordeal. Survive! How long can you hold your breath? I, I was literally just listening to a TED Talk Woo. this morning. Well, it was more like a... It was the TED Talk radio hour they have on NPR, and... They were talking about. They were talking to David Blaine and about him hold, and he can hold his oh, breath underwater. Yeah. He like broke the world for record, like for the same like he did it in amount. like I think he did it in like 17 minutes. He held it for, but Holy someone broke. He did that in like back in the mid 2000s or mid late 2000s, and then someone actually broke it in 2012, and they held their breath in Germany. Oh yes, snippets. <laughs> the mutant. I knew there was yeah. a fight. Ah! Oh Collect the jiggy. Yeah. But you're talking about David Blaine? Oh, Somebody yeah. Well, broke it. someone broke it in like 2012 and they held their breath. Like some, maybe some guy in Germany and he held his breath for like 22 <laughs> minutes. Yeah, we got everything. All, well, all the... All the notes. Right. Sorry. Yeah, right. Eat it, mutant. See, instead of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, they're just mutant crabs and then they're assholes. Ah! Mutant crabs. Instead of eating pizza. Isn't that, isn't that what your mom had? Mutant crabs. <laughs> Is that what you gave her? That's that's kind of <laughs> that kind of hurts both of us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, how? But how? How could they hold their breath that long? I mean, no. That's insane. Well, like well, they, what was the Ted talking about? <laughs> oh, um, it was actually not. about fear. And oh, David Blaine essentially like I mean because he does all those crazy acts of right of, of you know things that like put you in very you know potential death situations or brain dead conditions. Um, yeah, the whole idea was, like, he, he's not really afraid of anything. I mean, he's probably more afraid of, like... Like, not, like, things as in, like... Like, you, you'd think people are, like, afraid of the dark. Like, he's obviously not afraid of the dark. He's not right. afraid of, like, being underwater and, like, drowning or anything. Uh -huh. or, or confined spaces, you know? Because he, like, lived in, like, a freaking glass case in London hanging in the air oh, for, like, 40-something like, days. Yeah. Which is weird as shit. Crazy. He's just, like, I don't know. He's, it's kind of And without... He ate... Like, he didn't eat or anything while he was he, in the He case? was in that thing for, like, 40-something days. With, how do like, you not... How do you not... Yeah, how do you survive, right? Right. I have no idea. You can't go, idea. like, without water for, like... Exactly. He, he didn't drink any water. I don't know, man. So the guy... I mean, his whole philosophy was that, you know, he can do stuff that, you know, like... Like, he's trying to push the human body to its limits, essentially, and, like... You know, I don't know. Yeah, it gets off on that, I guess. <laughs> it's weird, but anyway, the whole underwater breath thing is what made me think of that. So, huh? So now we're, we have pretty much everything, but we're missing a honeycomb. Yep. I have One no idea. Honeycomb. Me neither. I'm is gonna it figure it in? Out. I want. I feel like it's in Clanker. 
But it yeah. potentially could be anywhere. <laughs> I was gonna say in the in the um, beginning, but we we I feel like we explored that pretty yeah. well. Uh, we know that was one over there, so I doubt they're gonna place another one near there. Um, gosh, I don't know. Yeah, dude, it's been a long time. I really don't know. I mean, I'll go inside Clanker. Just kind of like brainstorm. Hmm. Where? Oh, where? God. Okay, here it's yeah, um. Well hidden. Go back. No, back. It's outside his stuff. It's outside. Yeah. Dang it. Uh, you gotta go to his left flipper. So I think you're going the right way. Okay. Yeah. I yeah. About this, so. Oh yeah, it's clever. I like that one. Yeah, I remember this one now that now that I read this. So. I see. I wish I, I would have more time. Like if I was uh, playing by myself, yeah. I would go we and would look just for find it. it. But we're not going to waste this time. So right. no, no, you're fine. Look behind you. So that pipe there. Oh, uh, see, you know what? What do you think you're going to do? Yeah, no. you're going to drop through though. No, no, no. Oh, you go. Down. Yeah. All right. Clever, right? I think yeah. that's a cool one because you don't necessarily know you can do that, even though it totally makes sense. Right. Ta -da. There it is. Yay! And we got a whole new energy. Nice. Yay. Cool. Good awesome. Job. That's everything. Dude, that, that is everything. Completes so I'll, I guess I'll Peace head back out. to the entrance. Mm -hmm. See ya, Clanker. I'm glad we could help you with your dental problems. Buddy. Yeah. And your fresh air. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yeah, see, that, that level wasn't that bad. No. It's just harder when you're a kid and you have no idea what you're doing. Yeah. And, I, yeah, I don't know why, like... I felt like it wasn't one of my favorites, but it, it's it is a lot of fun, dude. They're all a lot of fun. Who am I kidding? A precaution. <laughs> ah! Ah! No! No! That's stupid that they didn't like put a ladder all the way up to the, the exit. Yeah, the, you have yeah. to like take the, the way back. Yeah, it's kind of very inconvenient. <laughs> Yeah, this is, I guess this is one of the levels that's a bit more inconvenient to get back to the entrance. Right. Um, eh, the rest of them, they're not bad. I don't remember most of them, so... <laughs> oh, dirt. <dear. laughs> I think this probably is the most inconvenient one, not gonna lie. Because all the rest are in. Wow, you best know, score for that level was 100. Yeah. Yay. It's now 100. We actually, that, was the, that was the first level where our note score wasn't 100 right off the bat. <laughs> yeah, that's because we died, right. Yeah. So that means essentially we, we are can go... well. We already filled in the puzzle piece there for Bubble for, Loop. Yeah. Go back so... to that main entrance. There was the um, ah switch yes, there. the eyes. The yeah, eyeballs. I totally forgot. Good. Yeah, I'm thinking the Gruntilda switch. <laughs> the lair switches. I'm still here. I watch you play, but I can't think. Of a m uh, much to say. <laughs> nice. Just ground pound these bad I thought, bad girls. For a second, I thought you could just step on them, but no, oh, maybe. it makes a lot more sense. <laughs> Came out of the nose. Ew. Gulp? I like doing that. Just going straight backwards. And that's that's Bubble Gloop, so we already no, heard. Not that Bubble Gloop, uh, Clankers. We, we, yeah, yeah, we, we already did, did Bubble Gloop. We did find Bubble Gloop more by accident. Oops. And then we go up, up here. here. Yeah. Oh, to the door. Yay. Dance. <laughs> dance, bear. Dance. <laughs> exactly. Cool. Awesome. And then... Ah, yes. This is one of the... I like this. Um... Because you can see the jiggy there, and it's just this big, like, I'll statue monument. I'll drop the crazy piranha fish in there. Oh, yeah. Can that you giant kill him? Teeth. No, I don't know. Oh. Gotcha, bitch! Dude, I don't think I ever tried to really kill him, because <laughs> I just never thought to try to ground pound him like that. It's funny. Nice. Yeah, because you can't, you can't attack while you're in water, right? So... Yep. Alright. Um... What's up there? Up here. Jump in the Jump in there, and then there's other spaces there's too over there. there. I think it's another node door over there. Oh, is it? Let's yeah, just look I think at that we real need, quick. We, we might only need. Oh, go talk to Brentilda. Brentilda, what you got? 
Lazy Sister often sleeps on a pile of treasure. That dirty hag. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing she's ever won was... The Dirtiest <laughs> undies competition at witch school. Yeah. She often boasts of appearing she on the cover of Fat Hag Monthly, posing in her long johns. Weird. Uh, dude, it's so the, gross. Like, her, like, Gruntilda's under will probably literally have cobwebs in them, <laughs> and that's considered <laughs> sexy, likely. Oh, yeah. Well, no. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> For those witches, I mean. I mean, except Brentilda. She's like the fa she's more like a fairy godmother bitch, than a witch. Yeah. So, yep, you're right. It's another no. We can go in there already. We yeah, we, we already, technically we already can, could already but leave, I'm but saying but, screw that. Yeah, because I think um the swamp is probably I think the swamp is on the other side. I think that's right. Yeah, I swore there was I guess she's back here. Oh, maybe I'm thinking of something else. Yeah, she's something. in the back alley. I mean, <laughs> the, the back of doing the her tricks. statue. I'll tell go you ahead. about tell you about my sister. Oh Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> my sister, Wendy. <laughs> uh, oh my god, right. I think okay. we're almost... We're pretty much at that time then, right? Yeah. We're oh yeah, we're a little over. over. So. Oh, oh there she is again. No, now, I'm yeah. not. There's the something else too over here, right? Yeah, there might be just like a dead end with some stuff. Oh, you know what it is? It's some boots. Dude, you're right! Boots! Hey, keep, keep your feet your out. out. Can't use this until you find models. Until you've spoken. Oh, oh yeah, nice. there you're right. Cool. It looks like some stuff underneath, it but it all looks uh Well, poisonous. we can talk to Bruntilda after the level. Oh, uh, that's what you need the boots for. Look at behind there. Oh my god. Here well, try to go underwater, Brandon. Uh, well. Oh my god, piranha! <laughs> <laughs> so, if you're wondering, that's why we're not Smelly going there now. feet out. <laughs> I think those get nice top. rubber boots protect them than piranha. Okay. Yeah, we're, um... Oh, over time, so we're yep. gonna Bubble Gloop's gonna be our next area. So very exciting. Tune in next time as we go to complete Bubble Gloop and solve the mystery of what Diddy Kong what Diddy character. Kong racing <laughs> character is in the game. Yeah, I'm very excited to figure this out now because I do not recall. So cool. All right, Thank guys, thanks for tuning much in. For watching. Yep. Till next time. <laughs>